How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Videos. Today I'm going to be doing the new Nexus 7 for beginners. And uh, this is going to be part one. And part one is basically just going to be uh, walking you through the setup screen. So if this is your first Nexus 7, you may not even know what you need to select in order to get it set up. So I kind of want to explain those things, walk you through that part. If you've already set it up, if you've kind of gotten past this, if you're a little more savvier but you want to get more information, jump over to part two and I go over more of the cosmetic look, the buttons, different things like that. But um, if this is your first time and you're a little lost, go ahead and take a look and, and we'll walk you through all the basics. So. Uh, first we're going to do is just choose our language here and if for whatever reason your language isn't English you would just swipe up or down and it will change. I am using the stylus pen here. You don't have to use this. All this will also work right with your finger. I just like to use it for demonstration purposes so my finger doesn't block the screen. So anyway, um, once you've chosen your language you're going to tap the arrow and that will take you to the next screen. Now this next part is asking you to select a wireless network. Obviously you have to have wireless internet to use the tablet. So if you don't have the internet um, there actually is no option to skip. So you have to have wireless internet in order to be able to set this up. Okay, So I'm going to connect to the network. It's morphing time. Now your house, your network might be named AT&T with some numbers or it might I have like Roadrunner or it might say like Netgear. You have to figure out what the name of your network is. If not, ask the person that set up your internet and there will be a password associated with this. So once you know which one is yours, like mine is it's Morphin Time, I'm going to tap it's Morphin Time and it's going to ask me to put in the password. So my password is Awesome Sauce. Awesome Sauce. Now, for most people, the password is just going to be their phone number. Uh, for other people, uh, again, depending on who set it up, it's just like a random like number letter combination. If you do have, uh, or everyone has a router, if you go check the router, the number will probably be on the side of there. The router is the internet box that broadcasts the internet. I know if you have AT&T, they definitely do put that number on the side of the box. And also... Some of you guys may want to check the show password option because to make sure you put in the right uh, combination. This is also case sensitive. So if there's a capital letter in there and you don't put the capital in there, it will not work. So make sure you get all the capitals and you get exactly the way it's supposed to be entered. Now we're going to tap connect. This will take a couple of seconds. It'll connect. Oh, there it is. And it will connect to your internet. When it's done, it's going to take you to this screen. Now, to use an Android tablet, you need to have an account with Google. But guess what? It's a free account, so don't worry. You don't have to pay for this. Uh, it basically is if you have um, a Gmail account, which is Google Mail, then you enter that. So, for example, I have a Gmail account, so I would tap yes, and then I'll put that in. If you don't have one, you would tap no. And they'll take you here and they'll let you create an account. And the create account part is really quick. You're going to basically put, you're going to uh, pick an email address that you want to be your email address. And then password, and they'll ask you a, a few questions. And that's it. You can do not now. I don't recommend it because in order to download the apps and to really interact with the tablet, you do need to have an account. So um, make sure you set this up, don't skip this. I'm gonna go back by pressing this back arrow because I do have a Google account and I wanna enter it. So I'm gonna hit yes. And I'm gonna put in, so H2 Tech Videos. Okay. And then I'll proceed to put the password in. Now I'm gonna take this off screen because I know you guys probably don't even care about what my password is. So I don't wanna show it to you since you don't care. Um, okay, so just entered the password. And from there, we just tap this arrow right here. And that will take us to the next screen. It's going to say you're agreeing to their terms and conditions. Press OK. And then it will sign you in. And then you have some other options here where it will actually back up the data from your account. Um, so the cool thing about that is like it will save like uh, apps, app settings, like your Wi-Fi stuff. So if you get another tablet and you log in, it will save 
some of your stuff for you to save you a little time. So uh, we want to keep all these checked, uh, except you may not want to have Google send you uh, junk mail about apps and stuff. You know, um, some of the emails are good, but some aren't, so it's up to you. Uh, and then this is location data, which is used like if you want to use the map feature. Certain apps have like deals, but to get those deals, they have to know what area you're in. So I would check it. You can always go back and uncheck that later. And then we're going to hit the arrow to go to the next screen. And it'll ask you to name your tablet. So I'll just keep the name H2 Tech Videos. And then we're going to hit the arrow. And that's it. And our setup is not complete. And it will take you to this screen, which is um, our uh, home screen. Okay. So uh, this has been the part one of how to set up your new Nexus 7. Make sure you check out part two and we're gonna go over what these little icons are, how to navigate the tablet, and just kind of those basic features like that, all right? Um, hope you guys found this helpful. Uh, make sure you like, favorite, and share the video. Follow us on Facebook, facebook.com slash h2techvideos, and on Instagram, at h2techvideos. Thanks for watching and have a good one.